So it's time for this old goat to retire. He's quite a well-behaved goat, right? He's quite, you know. His name is Alan, and here he is, trotting along the streets of this English village called Simford Ferris. And for the past four years, our goat here has been gainfully employed as an egg delivery boy. Okay, here we go. Okay, don't eat the sage. Goats like Alan here are typically sold for meat, but his owner, who originally bought the guy to help produce milk and cheese at her farm, also thinks that animals should serve a purpose in the community. Hence, Alan's daily egg rounds. Oh, hi, Sue. Good morning. <laughs> morning, David. How are you doing? Doing good, thanks. Now you got some eggs for me today? I have. Uh, Alan, don't eat the sage. <laughs> Thank there you, you go. Very much. Lovely. You're uh, welcome. I've got some money for you too. Okay, that's great. All right. Sorry. Um, I for the kindling as well with the egg. Oh, thank you. Here we go. Thank you very much. This hairy egg courier has become something of a minor celebrity, serving customers like these on the two mile long trip around the village. Well, he eats my flowers for me and uh, various things like that, and uh, he's a real character. <laughs> and uh, well, I had to build a man here. He said, I have never seen anything like this in my life. He was just amazed. Our goat here isn't necessarily retiring because he's sick of the daily grind and just wants to kick back and watch some Wheel of Fortune. Two years ago, he was injured in a horse attack and it's simply time to call things quits. So yeah, you might think that the goat is Tom Brady or that experimental Swedish rock band, but for this little English village here, uh, well, the, the goat was something that brought them eggs for a while.